everyone, this is Tita Esther. Thank you and welcome for joining me in my YouTube channel. Today is the third episode of Ferdinand's Poetry Reading. Today is Saturday and Saturday is Ferdinand's Poetry Day. As you know, every Saturday at 12 p.m., we are uploading two new poems from the selections of Ferdinand's Poetry. The path of spiritual growth and life. I am trying to understand what is behind and write about it. Poetry has become a part of my life. It was really a very nice weather this week. In Felden it was foggy and cold, but up in the mountain it's really warm and sunshine. So Ferdinand, what was your highlight this week? I went to a lake nearby with my wife Merle and we counted ducks. Really? And how many ducks were there? 125! <laughs> 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 that was really interesting. So, Freddy, uh, what uh, poems are we going to read today? Today we are going to read the first poem. Is What you are going to read is The Secrets of the Universe. Yes. It is about the way of life mm -hmm. which uh, we go. Life sometimes is full of twists and turns, mm -hmm. surprises and unexpected moments. It uh, reminds me of the Bible which says God works in mysterious ways yes, because exactly, life sometimes yes. is mysterious. Mm -hmm. So I set my mind to it and the first poem is about this. Mm -hmm. And the second poem is about autumn, about mm -hmm. the colors of autumn and the light of autumn uh, because I wanted to write a poem about each season and this is uh, now we're living in the autumn. Yes. Now this is, uh, I'm going to read the poem about autumn. The Secret of the Universe by Ferdinand Blaschkin Some of the secrets of the universe are hidden in a box of treasure, which we are supposed to look for in our life. Sometimes the path of our search is full of sunshine, very clear and bright. We have an easy time. Sometimes it is very difficult to go. The trail is filled with troubles and with trials. We have to sweat and work it out so that we can receive a spark of light. How can we go on with a quest for the secrets of the universe when we discover the box of treasure? In the end, we are curious about its unique content. When we open it, after having prayed with thanks, we are often taken by surprise by what we see and find. A map with a path to our heart, a picture of our eternal mate, a message of heaven and of God, hints how to walk that road. And the day when we end our time on earth to start our way into 
eternal life. I hope you enjoyed listening to these poems and let me hear with Ferdinand Blaschke with his Light of Autumn. The title of the poem is Light of Autumn, of Deutsch, Licht des Herbstes. O oh, du schöner Tag des Herbstes, der du ruhest in der Stille, deines Lichtes, das du wirst auf die bunte Blätterwelt, die in Rot, Orange und Gelb dich widerspiegelt. Die Sonne dieses Tages, sie möchte uns sagen, Sehet her, noch einmal send ich des Lichtes strahlen, sauget auf in eurem Herzen die letzte Wärme, mit der ihr dann könnt schmelzen die Kälte der langen Nächte. Thank you for listening to my poems and I would be very happy if you leave your comments in the comment box. Thank you very much. By the way, Ferdinand, what was this? Yeah. You were counting 120 ducks? No, yes, it was 125 and many, many swans. <laughs> really? So, and uh, again, another thing, one of the viewers told me that we should not make high five, but we should do the pandemic way of saying hello and goodbye. So, Ferdinand, bye and hello. Till bye. next time, and I hope you will stay tuned on Saturday, 12 o'clock, the same place and same time. Bye!